ministry should never be a competition to prove that you are better than someone else. Uh, did you know that God still speaks through his prophets today and his word, of course, through the Holy Spirit, through both? Okay, this is what the Bible says about ministry and about people who um, feel the need to tear down others and they've become very petty. Uh, and in essence, what I'm talking about is we've got to be careful not to do this. This is 1 Timothy chapter 6, verse 4. They are covered with the clouds of conceit. They are loaded with controversy, and they love to argue their own opinions and split hairs. The fruit of their ministry is contention, competition, and evil suspicions. So there are people that are very critical of others and that what they really have is they have suspicion. That's not discernment. There's a difference between discernment and suspicion. So what I've seen is, is there's people that have perhaps been in ministry for a very long time and they feel very intimidated and threatened when God raises up new leaders that are anointed, that are called into ministry. And what can happen if somebody's not very, very careful is that they can actually begin to tear down somebody that God is truly using. In the word of the Lord in Psalms 105 verse 15 says, Touch not mine anointed, and do my prophets no harm. I'd like to share another scripture with you. This is out of Proverbs chapter 20 verse 3. A person of honor will put an argument to rest. Only the stupid want to pick a fight. So, I just bring you this message out of love and concern that sometimes what I see is that there, there definitely are two groups of people. There's people going into ministry, there's people that are already in ministry, and I've seen both groups. And what can happen is, is people who are very eager to get into ministry can start tearing people down who are in ministry already, and, we're, and those people aren't supposed to do that. And then there's the people that are already in ministry, and they're threatened and intimidated by new people coming into ministry so then they tear them down and both parties are wrong there should be no competition so when people become very petty jesus said you will know them by their fruit so if that's you just repent it's it's a word a, a word of warning and love god loves you but he does send his prophets to speak the truth when people need to be corrected god bless you and have a great day in jesus name